We are the Redbeard Pandas. R. One of our favorite outreaches is teaching the Scouts BSA Robotics Merit Badge. In this Merit Badge, we teach the students how to build and program the robots how to and how to stay safe while doing that and how they are important to, in society and how you might be able to get a career in it. The way we teach this usually takes seven hours to fulfill the requirements. If this is a one day event, we suggest that you split into two groups. Then at around lunch, you rotate the groups so that way everyone gets all the requirements done. If you're doing this as a multiple day activity, then we recommend starting each day with some of the classroom requirements before getting on to the challenges. This is the requirement of the merit badge to observe a competition, but we like to make our scouts uh, compete in a competition. Of, It also takes care of the requirements to build, program, and test of the robot. This is the challenge that we present to the scouts. We normally have two of these mats, so that way scouts can compete head to head um, in a competition to see who can have their de robot deliver the CD in the ring. This encourages them. Uh, this encourages them to continually improve the robots and programs. Uh, scouts earn five points for the disc being partially in in the target. Scouts earn ten points for it being completely in the target and scouts earn an additional 10 points for their robot being the first to score in the target. We usually pair scouts up into groups of two but it can, to encourage teamwork, but it can be done with more or less. And we give each team a basic Lego tri a basic Lego tribot so that they can start working right away. Each team comes with a robot and a laptop with a basic line following program loaded onto it. We walk them through the logic of the line following program. For example, that if you if the sensor sees white, turn left, and if the sensor sees black, turn right. For building, it, each group has to add on their own color sensor or, and decide if they are going to just drag the CD behind the robot or make their own custom CD dropping device. For programming, scouts have to determine when to tell the robot to stop, how fast the robot should go, and discover any further optimizations that they could add. The classroom content is where we teach the rest of the requirements, like safety, terminology, and use in industry. Unfortunately, this can lead to boredom. So make sure to ask the scouts plenty of questions and show them exciting videos about robotics. We also have a ready-made slide show that you can use that has a lot of merit badge info on, on it. Link in the description below. The robot merit badge is a great tool to engage people if you have the lesson plan set up. If you have any questions, please contact us at either our website or on our Facebook page. Thank you for watching and we hope you have some fun teaching the robotics merit badge.